Okay, so this day is going to be, this day is going to be crazy. I, I think, I think I'm here for you, right? Yes, okay. I'm Rob. Hi. Hello. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hello. <laughs> What's going on? Got a message last night. We're doing some filming today. This is my vlogging camera. This is what I make all of my videos with. So today, come to Gangnam with me. This, today I'm filming with this beautiful group of people. Uh, they're taking me around and we're gonna go try some food, see the culture, try a market, and we're just gonna go have some fun today. Hi. <laughs> Can you introduce yourself to my vlog? My name is Jung Wan Ju. Nice to meet you. Your name? Hi. My name is Jie. Jie. Oh, English name is Noel. 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 Seyong. Yeah. Seyong. I'm really excited for this. Uh, they're basically planning everything and came to pick me up and now we're, uh, we're taking off to go try some markets, try some food, explore and see, see what we can find today. Waving to a camera. First stop for the day is the beach. Part of the day is just spent uh, being a tourist and exploring the, the other side of Korea that you don't necessarily see with the Olympics. When you're in the bubble, all you see is the village or your venue and you don't get to come and see amazing beaches like this. There's a helicopter there. That looks to me in the distance like a big ship. I don't even know what it is, but it's a big ship. It's crazy to go to a beach at the Winter Olympics, but this is where we're at. Part of today is they want to see and videotape me vlogging and uh, and showing the beach and, and doing what I do to showcase the behind the scenes I guess of YouTube and as I'm walking through the beach uh, I just flew the drone which was awesome and then five minutes later that that loud sound was a fighter pilot making sure everything's okay on the beach okay not, not this, side. this side this side really cool to have that the backdrop and then the Winter Olympic Games being happening over there. And now today I'm on the beach. Behind the scenes. Three cameras right now, all filming in this direction. Four. No, this is my third time in Korea. For me it's the end of the games. The women's race finished yesterday. And then I moved out of the Athlete Village yesterday and I have two days left in, in Pyeongchang area and then I fly back home tomorrow.
I gotta try and get this with my other camera. This is a huge plane boat thing. I have a feeling this vlog is going to be very, very fun, very long, and very random, which is great. But one thing I was just struck with is how much I enjoy seeing people together and taking photos and uh, trying to create memories of the trip that they're on or the, the day that they're having. It's the whole reason why I vlog. It's fun to see a whole bunch of people doing the same thing. You never know what you're gonna find on the beach in Korea. We got a, a National Coffee Week festival. There's all sorts of handcrafted coffee and coffee cube things, and here's a whole history of coffee itself. 1890 to 2000 and something. Okay, at this coffee festival, the, you can roast your own coffee. Coffee beans from Ethiopia. I've got Ethiopian coffee beans that I'm going to try. I'm going to try and roast them. They look a lot different than when they're not roasted. It's a lot of pressure. I have just successfully roasted my own coffee beans and she says I'm the best roaster in Gangnam. Best teachers in Gangnam. From green to dark brown. Dark brown is a stronger coffee, that's what I wanted. Oh. <laughs> so good. Thank you. Bye. I just successfully roasted my own coffee beans. They'll be ready in three days and they smell delicious. And then I was given, I got a Brazilian coffee, which is also delicious. And now I get to enjoy a delicious coffee on the beach, Angmok. That's really good. Really good coffee. Really good. Time to go to the market. This is the market, we're here. Uh, I've never seen a market like this. There's, I was here last year and we didn't see this at all. It's really cool, I'm excited for this. Part of the market is there's all sorts of little pop-up shops and different things and they've got a giant screen playing curling back there where everyone's sitting down and watching. And it's, ah, the weather is so nice for this. Like it's warm, there's a little bit of a wind but it's not, it's not too cold. And so you can spend hours outside if you wanted to, enjoying, enjoying all of this, the sights and sounds. I'm excited because I haven't been able to see any part of this before because I was in the village for so long that your village and then the track and then the village. But now I get to walk and wander and see the tourist part of the Olympics. And it's, it's like, I kind of wish I had saw, seen this before we started competing. It's getting me going again.
Bir şat, bir şat. He teach he teach me and I got better immediately. It's it's all about the secret. You have to kick this. You have to find this and make sure you hit that. Come sound it up. I push and now you jump. Okay, okay. It's on the side too, so you can fall off to the side if you're not ready. Come on, bro. We just played a whole bunch of games, tried four new Korean games, a hacky sack style game, a top spinning game, and a balance board game. We played very tiring. We're working on uh, the market opening scene now. I'm testing my acting skills all day. I have a couple things I need to say. Once traffic dies down and people drive die down, I gotta to say Anyang Haseo, my name, I love Korea. I think something about the market. We'll see. You ready? Uh, Canada SAO Robert Ao. We're gonna find something for me to eat. Oh, come okay. You buy? Yeah. You eat. Okay, so anything I wanna eat. Yeah. Ooh, what? <laughs> What's, what do you think is a, the, the best thing? What should I try? Okay, today we're going to the Korean traditional market. Let's go. I gotta, I gotta find some food. Is this spicy for you or just for me? It's just me. It's just for me. No problem for you. But for me. I've never enjoyed such tasty food. This is this is spicy for me. Not spicy for you. No problem. For me, very spicy. Delicious. 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 And spicy, but not for you. No spicy. <laughs> This has been a blast. Beach, coffee, market, games. Actually, great last day too, because tomorrow I'm flying. This is where I have to say goodbye. Bye. Thank you very much, Kamsamnira. Thank you. I can't wait to see what, what they make. That was lots of fun. That was a great day. Bye. Bye, Thank you. Kamsamnira. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. That was great. Okay, that was so much fun. And I, maybe I didn't make it as clear as I could have up during the day, but last night at like 11.30 p.m., I got a message from the host of a morning show on MBC, which is the biggest broadcaster in Korea, so I've been told. They asked if I was free and I wanted to do something. They wanted to shoot something with me because they saw my vlogs and they liked it. So I naturally said, yes, of course. 15 days ago, 16 days ago, I hadn't even uploaded a single Olympic vlog yet. And now on episode 17, I, w I spent the day with NBC. And uh, <laughs> it's just absolutely insane to me what, what can happen when, when things pick up. <sighs> so stoked. Oh, yeah, I should mention as well that tomorrow I'm going to be on a flight. I don't know when that vlog is going to get edited because of the time difference. I, my flight leaves at 5 p.m. on the 20th, but I arrive in Vancouver at like 10 or 11 a.m. on the 20th because of the just confusion that is time zone flying and flying back in time. So I have no idea when the next vlog is going to get uploaded and I have no idea what's going to happen. I've got a few vlog ideas I want to do, so I don't know what's going to happen in the next coming days. I have a feeling I'm going to be just completely exhausted, so I might take a day or two to rest and gr regroup myself and, and everything there. But uh, the vlog is not ending. The journey is not ending. If you were worried about that, don't be. And if you weren't worried, stay not worried. I'm gonna edit now. Thank you for joining today and good night. I'm gonna need to explain this tomorrow, but today's five seconds of gratitude is for being able to film with NBC.